Okay, in this question, a ball is tossed vertically upwards with a speed of uh, 5 meter per second. After how many seconds will the ball return to its initial position? So it means like there is uh, this ball and it is thrown upwards with a speed of 5 meter per second. And after how much time will the ball reach back again? So uh, there is um, in this question, like uh, there are many formulas which we can directly apply and we can find what will be the answer. And I know that uh, the formula is like 2u by g, if I'm not wrong, uh, might be, let me see, 2 into 5 divided by 10. So it is one second. And yes, the answer is one second. Okay. So uh, that is okay. But from where this formula comes, now that's the big thing. So uh, let me tell you this. Okay. Now there is this formula that S is equal to UT plus half AT square. Very famous formula in kinematics. But when we, when we apply this in uh, the motion under gravity concussions, so what we do is we take one direction as a positive, another as a negative. So we can take gravity as negative and the velocity as positive because we have actually thrown it upwards. And we will apply the formula. This is a vector equation. We must be knowing this. So we need to understand where the origin is. Origin is uh, taken to be the initial position. So this point is O. So all the distances will be measured with respect to O. So from O, if you see the body is going upward and upward is positive. I'm just now putting the value. See, so the body from A, from O, it goes to A and from A, it goes to B. So in the total journey, the ball is coming back to the same location as the earlier. So what is the total displacement of the body in the time T? Zero, because it has reached the same point. So we will say that the displacement is zero. Velocity in the upward direction, so it is five. And we need to find T. So this plus half. And what will be the acceleration? It is G, which is which can be taken as 10, but it will be downwards. So it will be minus 10 into T square. We need to solve this. So 5T minus 5T square, 0. T will be taken out and... Okay, 5T will be taken common, sorry. Or I can do it like this t is equal to one second although we know that the formula that is to be used for this kind of a case is t is equal to 2u by g that is the general formula it can be applied everywhere okay so this is it all the best bye